What's up, fellow classers? It's Apollyon here, and uh, you know what? We're going to mix things up a little bit. We're going to do some live attacks, and uh, oh man, this is going to already go bad. I, uh, I can already tell you, the number four hitting our number 34. So, hmm. Uh, yeah, this is... And the sad thing is, the, the, the composition that he has could potentially not even get three stars. So this is... This is the kind of stuff we're going to go against on this war. It just started about two minutes ago. They drew first blood, but uh, yeah. Uh, it's pretty cool that the goblins are going to go ahead and uh, that, that Town Hall 10. But um, I'm going to go ahead and try to, to ninja some live attacks um, and uh, you know see some of the stuff that's going. But they're, they're not taking care of this clan castle. So uh, finally they get the rage with the, the dragons down there. But these uh, air defenses are going to do some damage to those dragons. So oh, there goes a, the black seeking line. He won't even get that. Uh, okay, the hogs will take care of that one air defense, but the other one is in. Yeah, this is this is a super fail. That that loon is still. Um, wow. The loon is still trailing, and he has nothing to take those that loon. So that loon will go ahead and demolish the rest of the army, even if the defenses don't. Uh, so, yep, they're number four, failing on our number 34. So, um, at least got the two stars. Two star attacks win wars. So, yeah, I don't don't think this is good. We did a little secret Santa type of thing. So we are going to, we had our bases called for us, the ones that we were supposed to hit with the troop composition. We are not allowed to... Um, uh, to scout the base, you just have to click the attack and you've got the 30 seconds to, to do that with. So we'll go ahead and we'll see, uh, you know, what we got going on and I'll get some ninja lives going here. All right. So we finally get a chance to get uh, ninja live. So looks like he had to bring a completely mass hog. So Hopefully the clan castle, well, did they not st put stuff in their clan castle? I guess not. All right. Well. So I guess the secret Santa, the one that picks the, the base, will, will determine whether, you know, it, it's a feasible army. Because obviously you can't pick mass hogs and uh, with nothing else and 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 have you know them kill the clan castle of dragons or loons so you know yeah this is going to be crushed so this one is already over yeah this is not going to be a fun war i mean it doesn't even look like they have their clan castle stocked so yeah this is completely crushed And he'll have the swag heal available too. So. There it is. Yay. All right. And swag poison. All right. Another live attack. Going, checking out Logan. Uh, hitting number 12 with, uh, uh it's gotta be, a, a cold blooded cause he's not level town hall nine. So brings his own golem and I'm guessing five extra hogs, but let's see if that's what it is. Lots of wall breakers, tons of wall breakers. They are going to fail there. They're not going to make it into that thing. All right, the hog's starting in, and uh, yeah, does like a, a kind of Asian wall. Try Tesla there. Um, God, they're all level one, I think, or level two. So yeah, Expo's doing some damage. Um,
Has one more heal, so I think he'll be able to push through. I think there might be a giant bomb there uh, somewhere by that. No, there's not. So, anyway, it looks like it's going to be completely crushed. Yep, no fast forward button. They do hit that giant bomb. Well, there always is that option of hitting giant bombs. So I think there's three, two triggered so far that I can see on the outsides. Maybe some of those wizards will go ahead and soak up some of those giant bombs. Um, and they still have to worry. Oh, there, there goes the other wizard on the bottom. So maybe not. Um, you know, they still have to get past that king too. Tons and tons of hogs. I mean, it's it's just the giant bomb. There is one more giant bomb spot, but I don't think they're going to hit it. I don't see any reason for them to hit it. So, yeah, it looks like they'll. this will be a three-star. Yep, they'll wipe out that king right here, and yeah, it's all over. Wow. Oh, wow. Wow, really close. That's craziness. Okay, good job, Logan. Looks like we got another alive attack from Ladiator in on uh, their number 19. Bring in a Goho. And don't know if it was Quad Quake. Yeah, it doesn't look like it was Quad Quake. It's just one Earthquake. I, I think, again, that was what he was given to, uh, was told to take. So, um, one Quake, one Poison, and three Heals. So, definitely a little different, a little bit tougher. Um, and I think we're also told what we can bring in the Clan Castle, too. So, he has to bring the Peck in the Clan Castle. So, Lisa will make kind of a way. The King looks like he's going to do his walk, so that's not good. Um, walk around the base. But um, does have a good amount of hogs with two more heals. Uh, probably would have saved that heal for the, all those hogs. I think it's a pretty compact base, so it's not like he's going to have to worry about um, healing any giant bomb spots. He just wants to make sure he can push through. Um, yeah, don't think they even had, a, unless they, they already took it down, a, a expo. So, yeah. This base should be pretty much crushed. I mean, that peck is tanking for all the other stuff. Use that heal on those top hogs. Top hogs. There we go. There we go. So, yep, that this base is completely crushed. And there's no fast forward button, so we'll just have to watch it. Pekka, she looks confused. Going back and forth. And yeah, the, so that that king walk is fine. And we're back to normal again. Good thing he healed those hogs up top. They hit that giant bomb face forward. All right, so nice attack. All right, we had double lives, one on uh, their side and one on our side. So we'll check out this. Uh, looks like, hmm, looks like a holo. Yeah, good. We haven't seen a holo in a while. So this is pretty cool. So sends the giant in the, to do some tanking, and uh, we'll go ahead and do a two four finger drop, and got to get into those uh, that core. Got to get rid of those um, uh, air defenses there, and uh, uh, to, in order to, to back in the loons. So oh wow, that's an interesting thing. And I would have sent the hogs up the middle, but okay, that's fine. He does that, and uh, yeah, they'll take out that AD. Okay, so it looks like this is going to be a success because all the ADs are down, the loons are sent on the back end, and they're completely crushing the base, and uh, yeah, it's pretty much over. Um, 
Yeah, it looks like the the traps were set to to ground for the hogs. They're taking care of it. Poison was dropped, and I uh, could swag the haste. Don't know, but uh, not ne not really necessary. Giant bombs are no longer a factor, uh, as the um, the loons will not be affected by them. But uh, you know, there could be some of those. Uh, they are pretty clumped up. So as long as they don't hit two or three three of those uh, red bombs. Uh, the air bombs, That's then everything should be alright. It looks like they're going to keep us uh, switching around, but uh, that king is going to go down in one shot right here. There we go. The, those those loons will take care of that. They're, they're, they're hit by the uh, one air bomb. Barbarians go flying. And it looks like that's it. Swags the heel. Swags the, ra uh, the, the haste. And it's all over. Nice job, Ron. All right. So those were some of the live attacks. So we won't show those uh, redone in uh, in this replay. But uh, you'll see some Town Hall 8s uh, take on some Town Hall 10s, 9s, and 8s. So let's start it off with Yona taking on uh, the, their number 4, which is a Town Hall 10 with an uh, Inferno. And yes, no clan castle, but does Asian Wall, which triggers two giant bombs right off the bat. Inferno Tower is, I think, a single. So uh, it's going to go roast one hog at a time. But those hogs will go ahead and make their way right into that Inferno. One shot it, boom, down. And uh, it's done away with. No clan castle means easy. So they'll go ahead and make their way through, even though they are getting hit by the king and the queen. Um, the queen is kind of picking them off one by one. You can see how much damage that she does, uh, which is why you got to take care of those queens if you can. But, uh, you know, he's just going to go come at this thing, the second Inferno, and uh, didn't even notice that there were uh, two of them there. So he's cleared off just about 75% of the base as far as defenses. So that's phase one. So that was his only goal. This was not a three-star attack. He's he's going for a two-star attack, and I guess freeing up, you know, some of our town hall nines to hit down a little bit lower, or you know, maybe try some a three-star attack or something like that. Uh, we didn't have the best showing on this war just because you know we blew him away and they didn't even try. So I will say he does the king swap here and throws in a, a wizard as well. Uh, but m and, unless he goes straight down south, which he is not, he doesn't really have to worry about uh, any defenses at all. Um, possibly, no, there isn't even any giant bomb spots. He's cleaned out most everything. So this is completely, we are in cleanup mode. So we'll fast forward this and watch these guys w work through the base. Uh, they will get that 50% in just a second right uh, here, well, 49 that uh, 50 percent will go ahead and uh, be the the, the uh, town hall plus that will make it a two star 50 percent plus the uh, the town hall that inferno is just in range to start roasting those wizards over an open fire very uh, festive holiday season wise and uh, that king is just about to go down but that wizard will go ahead and take out the uh, the clan castle building and the mortar will finish this one off as long along with the cannon. So there you go. How you get two stars with a town hall eight going against a town hall one or town hall one town hall ten with dual infernos. So very nicely done, Yona. It's a lot uh, um, uh, more difficult than you made it look. So we've already seen Logan on the live attacks take number I think twelve. So we'll see him get a. Th six star war on his second attack against uh, number 13 which is a town hall nine um he's going to go ahead and mass hog and i think he brings five hogs in the clan castle again just like to show you these bases on how you can hit up uh, i know the, you guys will probably run into these type of bases very poorly designed very rushed very low walls but you know they still have two expos here uh, you know, still have a, a bunch of extra defenses that Town Hall 9 has instead of Town Hall 8. So he'll go ahead and do the uh, poison against these skelly traps. That is all the skelly traps that Town Hall 9 has to offer. So he can go ahead and send his hogs in here with a four finger drop and then uh, a separate finger drop at the end. Send some on the back end there or the front end. 
and uses two heels to push them through. He really needs to get through that expo. The hogs are standing in heels as they just reach to that expo. Um, they do not have an enemy queen, I don't think, so they don't have to worry about that. Uh, he has one more heal left, so he's going to go ahead and get that huge, huge group of hogs. Some of them go to spring traps, and uh, they only have these last two um, uh, archer towers and then the final AD. So they do hit a giant bomb, but they're standing in a heal while they hit it, and it's just in cleanup mode. So nice attack, Logan. Way to get that uh, six-star war and a nice three-star attack here. Okay, let's go to 20 to see another Mass Hog. Remember, even though these guys have no cl uh, clan castles, uh, it's still they still have to hit this with you know a good precision. Those defenses are still Max Town Hall 8s here. So, you know, it's no clan castle means they can do it a little faster and they skip the, the lure part, save a couple of... of um, of, it, of units that they don't they don't need to expend on that but uh, the strategy needs to be the same so just we'll just pretend like this is right there is the clan castle kill and he has done the lore so that's pretty much what it was so this is the real start of the raid just like it would be any other time so they eat uh, a face plant right there of a giant bomb and they all go down on, on that bottom group it yeah, doesn't heal it he wants to save his three hogs for them pushing into that core um, and uh, they'll, they'll go ahead and start making their way all converge into that core is when he's going to drop the heels here uh, as all those hogs meet up. Enemy King is pounding on some of them. Uh, one of them goes to a spring trap. He could drop his, uh, um, his friendly King uh, in order to tank for one of the Teslas, drops a wizard there to take care of that. The other uh, couple of hogs eat another giant bomb. So we are almost hogless here. Uh, they have one more. A hog that's going to be the semi-hero hog, and he does not get that Tesla down. Um, almost, but the Skelly Traps and the King go ahead and uh, knock him out. So that Barbarian King's bang banging down the wall, gets it. He's going to have to deal with that uh, Tesla hitting on him as he hits the um, storage. And, uh, you know, stupid Barbarian King. Just If something's hitting you like a Tesla, go ahead and take a sidestep and go for the Tesla. But, of course not. That's not going to be the way it goes. So he does rage up, uh, and then, then eats a giant bomb, one swipes that Tesla. We'll go ahead and fast forward this. As he's still banging on the wall, he'll make his way in here. Uh, he'll tank a little bit for that wizard, I think. Possibly. One hit. And that wizard will get two hits in, but still not enough. Uh, he does have two heals uh, that he's held. I don't know why, but maybe it was a guy. I don't know, but uh, whatever it is. So these last wizards will go ahead and be the hero wizards. They will knock out the uh, jo the barbarian king while that uh, barbarian tanks. One of them decides to make a detour and go. Oh yeah, we forgot that uh, builder hut all the way out there. Let me go back there and get it. The other ones will start uh, with the way they pound it with the lightning to get into that clan castle. And they will go ahead and take care of it. So down to the wire. One of the uh, wizards of the last three goes to fly into a spring trap. So two hero wizards will go and share beer together after the end of this and talk about uh, how they save the day. All right, a couple more. Let's watch uh, Go Val Ho here. Um, go Val Ho Lo. And um, we'll watch uh, SGK come here and wreck this Town Hall 9. And uh, I think this might have been a secret Santa of why we're waiting so long here. He's got to scout the base and decide where he wants to come in. So he's going to go ahead and heal up uh, these hogs. He wants to get a lot out of them. I think we're thinking that there's a giant bomb there, but there is not. These guys placed their giant bombs really, really weird spots. All of them, a lot of them were on the outside. So he heals up this again. Um, I'm not even sure what he's doing, to be honest with you. But this is just an interesting attack to use those hogs to basically just systematically take out i guess he's he's going in here and taking out the air defenses for the lows so for the loons so they're they're sacrificial uh hogs to go ahead and take out there when he drops in the loon so he will uh use quad quake 
has no more heals left. Uh, they got Everybody's got to do their thing without any more spells. So drops in the Valkyries. The king cheats a little bit and uses his ability, which is kind of like a spell, but uh, not quite. And all the ADs go down, so it's time to send the loons on the back end. So he drops some of his loons down. He has uh, uh, 10 more, 11 more. To, he's going to completely swarm this base. Valkyries are running inside the core, taking out some of the Teslas. These uh, loons, there's a balloon parade here. They're going to go take out those cannons up top with absolutely no problem as the cannons can only watch in horror as the bombs are being dropped on top of them. And uh, just have to deal with that last archer tower and wizard tower. Wizard tower is down. Now all we got to do is worry about that archer tower. Uh, just a few more. One uh, black seeking mine takes out one of those balloons and we are on cleanup. Uh, Valkyries are swiping through, eat a giant bomb, but they don't care. It just tickles, and they'll go ahead and move on, eat another giant bomb, but they're still ticking. And, uh, yeah, power of those Valks, man. They, they just go ahead and shrug off those giant bombs. All right. The last one. Uh, I wish I could show you some, you know, better stuff, but uh, it's really just the attacks. I mean, it's really just the bases we were given. We'll see a go low here with a P.E.K.K.A. thrown in there. So he's bringing a Shattered Entry, Quad Quakes to get in, bring some Wall Breakers to come in on that south compartment. Um, you know, basically it would do the exact same thing even if there was a Clan Castle or uh, units in the Clan Castle. Just, you know, exactly the same strategy with no lore. Bring in the Wall Breakers, he would trigger the Clan Castle right here, and uh, the Wizards would all collapse and start taking out those, but we don't have to worry about them. He sends his Valkyries in there, sends his uh, another Wizard to back them up, start doing some damage. Does have two heals left, so he drops one of them down when they start converging into this core. And uh, those Valkyries going a little bit slow, but they're still doing fine. Uh, Golems are healing up, Pekka's healing up, everybody's healing up. And uh, it drops those loons in really quick because he's got um, a good feeling that these Valks will make it through with that heal. So they are taken out. Uh, that one uh, AD is left, and it's just about to go down, but it does get three shots and takes out a balloon. But that's fine. Uh, all these Teslas are, are tanking in the core. Um, well, they're not tanking. The Golems are, the King are tanking those Teslas. And uh, yeah, it's, it's almost over. There is a few more balloons, which he drops in here for that last wizard tower and archer tower. And uh, then it is pretty much good night. There's a lot of these uh, bombs that are going off. But uh, there's, he's got way too many balloons for that to even make a difference. Drops a minion in there up top. Wizards are cleaning. Valkyries are running around hitting walls. So everybody's doing their thing. So very, very nice. Um, you know, we hit the bases with, uh, you know, what they gave us. Uh, no clan castles. Uh, still doesn't make it completely simple. Makes it a little easier, a little bit better on time. But the strategies have to be the same. So hopefully you all were able to take these attacks. Um, and, uh, you know, also seeing the, the first attack against us, you can see what kind of attacks that... These are normal attacks. This war that we're currently in right now, um, I, I think I got... I don't even remember what it was. It was like a dragon and golems and maybe a P.E.K.K.A. thrown in there. I, I, I don't completely remember. We, we got some weird attacks. Um, so never mind that. Let's just look at one quick more. Um, eh, just for the heck of it. Uh, we're going to see a weird Town Hall 8 design with this those wooden or whatever kind of walls those are, those brand new walls. He's going to bring, um, well, kind of like a mass hog, yeah. I would say, yeah, mass hog. I don't know what's in the clan castle. Oh, more hogs. Look at that. So, you know, three heals for this and, uh, you know, going to go ahead and make their way through this base. Uh, hogs go flying and uh, drops the... Uh, uh, the Barbarian King a little premature, I would say. You know, it's tanking for the um, those hogs, but uh, you know, it, it was it's been tanking for a while. It didn't need to be tanking that long, but uh, that's just nitpicky. It doesn't matter. He crushes this base completely, so it really makes no difference. One more uh, defense left, and we're done after that air sweeper is gone. And we'll go ahead and the 
oh, there was one more. And then they'll turn on that king that was chasing them, and it'll be all over. So hopefully you were able to take these, uh, you know, attacks. Keep in mind that the clan castle was, you know, not full. Just go ahead and do your lore normal. Barbarians and wizards kill, and then, you know, the attack uh, after that would hold true. So go ahead, get those six-star wars, and uh, get those three-star attacks in there.